Let's talk about employee confusion. This is a habit response for lack of desire to execute. So often I will hear from attorneys, we have this conversation, we have this meeting, we have a direction, st strategies, and come back and they're like, oh, I was confused. It's a common workplace challenge. When employees display confusion, often it's a habit response, which hampers project execution. It also decreases the attorney's confidence that people are taking control in managing their work and planning their work and working their plan. And a lot of times attorney uh, clients and a lot of times employees will say, well, I was confused. I was confused. Well, let's just stop that as a natural response when we to anything, especially when we're facing complex, complex tasks or maybe unclear directions um, where maybe it doesn't necessarily indicate a lack of capability or motivation that a lot of times attorneys will say that. Some cases, it's simply a habit response, or it's that we don't have communication best practice approaches in place to clarify and verify when we're confused. I will hear, especially employees, team members, if you're a high fact finder, I'll hear often that, well, I just want to hear everything, then go back and process it and then be able to come back with my response or my questions. Well, in small business, in law firms, heck, even in big corporate law firms, what have you, we don't have the time for that or the space or grace. So allowing for that, I just want to clarify and verify and do that debrief at the ever. We're not going to negate your process to want to go back and process and then ask further communication. That's why we have the daily huddle. But if you're not ending each meeting with the debrief and getting very clear on every end and making certain that everybody's clear what the next action, what's being asked of you, and then being able to go back and process and then come to the daily huddle and say, I'm complete with my processing for now. And here's what I'm understanding. And this is what I believe my proposed solution is in my next right stead. Because when we get to the root causes, which will eliminate assumptions, a lot of times I'll hear people aren't motivated, they're not taking responsibility, all of this garbage, which is untrue. It is really a system for clarity and to get us out of the place of confusion. So if you're hearing... I'm confused. If you're feeling confused, that's a good news because there's a solution. And get in the framework for how we conduct water cooler conversations, executive meetings, strategic meetings, uh, weekly meetings, daily huddles, what have you, ending with a debrief and making certain that there's a deadline attached to it while honoring your Colby, while honoring your need to process, research, whatever it might be, but there's a due date and accountability attached to that. So if you have a law firm of confusion and a law firm that is suffering with this knee-jerk reaction and response of, I was confused and you're hearing that and this word is triggering you today, reach out and let's get on a call and let's come up with a system that works for your firm to eliminate any future confusion. Control freak, it's what my staff thinks. They may be right. Because this treadmill of dread running through my head Keeps me up at night I'm so tired of micromanaging How do I train, manage, and lead? I can't find time to be visionary Head down in the weeds We're gonna tighten up this operation 
We're gonna build a strong foundation. No more chaos and confusion. We'll build a team that brings solutions. I see what could be, and I can't wait. Law firm admin boot camp is the way. We're signing up today. Law firm admin boot camp is the way. I've heard if you have a lot of chaos in your life, there's a great law firm admin boot camp that can probably help you out with that. Check it out. <laughs>